Andy's here. Oh, you know it's a, it's going to be a good day when I've got a thumbs down before I even uh, start. I love it. Good to see you, Andy. SSP in the house. Good to see you. <clears throat> I'm digging it. I'm loving it. How y'all doing? Y'all doing okay? Sorry, I needed a drink. Parker! Good to see you. Hi, Tina. How you doing? It's good to see you as well. <laughs> Hobby! What's up, Hobby? How you doing? Fitzy! What's up, Fitzy? Good to see you, my friend. Uh, I got three packages we're going to knock out today, and then we might open something. I don't know. We shall see. Hey, Jude. Happy New Year to you as well. Oh, I miss you too, Tina. You're such a sweetheart. You missed the intro? Well, welcome back, Andy. Don't worry about it. Peds, what's up, Peds? Jaffa, what's up, Jaffa? I had a good time in your stream the other night. It was fun. It was a good time. Work is finally starting to slow down a little bit, so I should be uh, less of a ghost. I will still be a tired ghost, apparently, but... It'll be all right. Additionally, the Sean Tiford video will be coming out today. It will be coming out today. The mail day from Sean Tiford. Uh, I am not going to edit it. It'll take me a week to edit that video. It's long as heck. Feel free to, to uh, fast forward through it and see because there's a ton of cool stuff uh, that Sean sent me. Um, so it's totally worth it. Uh, but I owe it to him and to everybody else to just go ahead and put it out instead of uh, BSing around forever. Just sorted six 3,000 row boxes. Wow. That's crazy. Elnegs, what's up? How you doing? All right, let me get the uh, obligatory shout outs out of the way at the beginning. Uh, Mr. Funkin' Mess Collections, the King of the North himself, Mr. Urban Card Breaks, Papa J Cards, doing his uh, 600 subscriber giveaway thing later today. Be sure to check that out. I believe he said 7 o'clock his time, which would be 9 o'clock here Central, 10 o'clock Eastern. Do the math. Uh, Mr. Will's Card Breaks, a.k.a. Wilmer Rodriguez, a.k.a. the King of Jackbox. Uh, Mr. Habe a searcher who is present in the chat at the moment and the LA collection uh, shout out to Mr. Reindeer Studios and uh, my good friend Dave Durango <coughs> your audio quality seems better today really uh, it might just be that I'm not sick anymore and I'm not exhausted because I had yesterday off too and I didn't really do anything but lay around and uh, recuperate you're hanging in there. I'm happy to hear that. I just realized I'm on top chat, which makes me an asshole. I apologize. Now we are on live chat. Let me make sure I didn't miss anything. No, it looks like I got pretty much everything. That's phenomenal. Uh, Andy, are you in here? You're in here, right? I'm going to start with you. Which one is yours? Take them down here. Boom. Uh, that's classic. That's OPG. Set you up. Yeah. Uh, shout out to Recycler for the lovely stash knife. Uh, uh, Lou Rock always says Army Strong. I'm gonna I'm gonna say Recycler Strong. There you go. That's the new thing. Gonna make a quick vid. Be back in a few. Okay, Parker. I uh, I gotta watch that one you did yesterday. What is this, Andy? What have you done? 
Andy Yu. Uh, also known as Andy Gee. Papa Jay's in the house. What's up, Papa? Uh, hey, Dan. What's up, buddy? How you doing? Can't stay long. Hope all is good. Hey, Lou. What's up, buddy? Sorry, I just saw that video uh, today and commented. My apologies. And I got your text, and I didn't text you back. I was busy, and I apologize. Um, but I will uh, I will get back with you. This is great. This is, uh, this is recycling at its best. There's a hot corner box. There's stuff inside of it, inside of a uh, one-touch bag. I love it. And we're into it. Spacer card. Gotta love a spacer card. Um, bum, bum, bum. We laid low all weekend. Hardly left the house. Much need. Yeah, I needed it too. Uh, I don't know, Papa Jack. I got your Christmas one. Uh, I don't know which package you're referring to. Papa Jay, I apologize. Uh, additionally, say hi to Mama Jay for me. Ken, good to see you, Ken. I hope you're doing well. I miss your face. Uh, ben Intendi rookie card. Lovely. Xander Bogart's rookie card. People know I love my rookies and my Red Sox. Devers, looking like he's about to commit an error. Xander doing Xander things. JD, could care less about that guy, to be perfectly honest. Mookie. Mookie. Benintendi, Holiday, gotta love it. Xander. JD. Ooh, Eck. Gotta love Eck. Love Eck. Mookie. Wall Climbers out of Big League. That's a really cool insert. I like that a lot. Uh, you have not got as of yet then. Should be there soon. Okay. Well, thank you for the heads up. I will keep my eyes open. Uh, I'm glad you're doing well, Ken. Uh, just got your package. Vid is going up tonight. Okay. Good to know, Lou. That's He's talking to Papa Jay. Haas. Good to see you, Haas. I hope you're doing well. Look at this gorgeous Ben Intendi. Um, this is what? Archives? No. Yeah. I forget. Uh, it's lovely, though. I really love it. I don't think I had that one. Ben Intendi Gold Cup. Can't go wrong there. Sweet, sweet victory. Something we didn't get this year. My Pats lost. It's all right. It happens. It happens. Oh, I don't have this in rainbow foil. That's awesome. It looks much better like this than it does uh, regular paper. Oh, oh, now I'm hungry. I want a hot dog so bad. Andy, I love it. Holy crap, Andrew Benintendi. Uh, Tops Holiday Relic. This is awesome. Thank you so much, Andy. I cannot thank you enough, my friend. Uh, let me catch up. Lou Rock's got to go. I'll talk to you later, Lou. Um, gotcha, Haas. Good. Everybody check everybody out for sure. Got some custom-made cards coming. Good, Ken. Um, doing well, Stash. Hope you're doing well. I'm I'm doing never better, man. Never bed. Never been better. Uh, Fenway does have awesome food. Uh, okay, one second. Uh, I'm gonna drop Andy's link to his videos in the chat. Andy, I do. If you are you still in here, Andy? Oh, there he is. That was a hot stash box. Oh, I love it. I love it. That's cute. Andy, look, uh, as your friend, I need you to spend some time on a laptop, a PC of some sort, and work on your page. Because when you open Andy's homepage, Andy, when I open your homepage, there's literally nothing. It says no recent activity. You have to click over to the videos to see that you have a ton of great content. So if you go to your editor on YouTube, you can set it up so that you can customize what people see when they go to your, your homepage. Okay. Uh, additionally, Andy's at uh, 114 subscribers. Everybody just take, a, check it, take a, a second and check to make sure that you're subscribed to Andy for me, please. Uh, 
And uh, Andy, definitely get that, uh, get your homepage set up um, so that you can recommend your newest video or your most popular video. And uh, because otherwise, if somebody's lazy, they click to your page, they see your home and it says no, no recent activity. And it looks like you don't make content. And we don't want people to see that. <clears throat> we want them to see the content. Okay, Andy, thank you so much. I really appreciate that one. Uh, who did I put second in the list there? Classic. We're going to go on to classic. I follow Andy. Good call, SSP. Good. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. I love Andy. He's a lot of fun. I can't wait to get over to uh, Louisiana and uh, bother him at work. In other words, go to a casino. <laughs> All right. And we are cutting into classics package right now. Oh, thank you, Papa J. Uh, dislikes are also encouraged. I'm okay with it. This looks, it looks curated. Hold on. Let me get all of this out here. Yeah. Thank you so much, Andy. I really, really love it. That Ben and Tendi uh, relic is super cool. Okay, there's a little thing here. Hold on. This says, okay. Congratulations, Philip, on being the winner of in our 12 Days of Christmas Team Pack giveaway. That's right. Classic was doing this really wonderful giveaway where you could leave a comment. And you could pick a turn of the century or new up-and-comer, two different kind of packs, and your favorite team. And I was lucky enough to win. You chose the Yankees turn of the century team pack. So I've included that and the next de decade counterpart as well. Enjoy. Just kidding. Of course, Red Sox included. Thank you again for all your amazing support, Eric. Uh, I love this. I'm going to put this up on the wall of fame as my tribute to classic cards until he gets a card or something sent out to me that is branded classic cards. Uh, I love the stickers. I, this is a secret passion of mine. I love the Red Sox stickers. This is one of my favorites. That's super cool. I love the hat. Holy crap. There is a mini. Oh, there's a part of a hanger. Is this? No. Wow. I've never seen this. Where it's just the one. That's cool. Series one and two. Oh, yeah. We are definitely going to rip that. That's going to be awesome. What is this? Baseball photo rub downs? A baseball photo is going to rub me down? Does it buy me dinner after? Bazooka has it all. It's the juiciest, bubble blowingest bubble gum around. You'll love the comics and great prizes too. So get a handful today. This is not sponsored by Bazooka, but that was fun to read. Um, I follow Andy. Yes, thanks, fellas and ladies. Hit that like button. Okay, good. I might be taking a job closer to you in Lake Charles. Oh, even better, Andy. That's even closer. Uh, yeah. Have fun at your meeting. I will talk to you later. Um, 80, 85 gum. I'm not eating the gum. Don't, don't even think about it. I'm not doing it. Okay, so it looks like he sent both of the packs. So that's got Alex Core on the front. That must be the turn of the century. That's got Mookie on the back. So that's the more recent. We're going to go with turn of the century. This is the one I actually, uh, the sexual undertones are doing it for me. Oh, I know you like that. Sandy. Good to see you, Sandy. Oh, look, it's even got a little Red Sox sticker on the back. It makes me happy. Uh, Alex Cora. Oh, wow. That's a cool Johnny Damon right there. Is that 2000? Tops 206. Interesting. I don't have any of these. I'm going to have to look into that. That's very cool. Frank Castillo. Frankie Castillo. Uh, Kevin Millar. Cannot read this. Bill Miller. He was really good. Uh, Johnny Damon. Ryan Phillips. This is a cool card, too. What is this? SP Prospects. I don't think I've ever seen that before either. Freaking year is that? 2004. Wow. Um, <laughs> at least lick the gum. I'm not doing it, Sandy. I'm not doing it. 
I love myself too much. Mark Loretta, Tony Clark, Noma, Eric Glazian, Big Poppy. It's a nice card too. What is that? There's a lot of cards in here I've never seen before. It's Tops 2005. Hmm. Okay. Kevin Millar again. Craig Breslow. Manny with an even bigger head. Love it. Timmy Wakefield. Wade Boggs. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's a lovely card right there. What is that? 2004 Upper Deck. Even the back is gorgeous. Look at that great shot of Fenway. Although this is not accurate. This would not be a 86 Fenway because it's got all the seats up on the monster. But it's a really gorgeous photo regardless. Jason, good to see you. I've missed you, Sandy. I hope you're doing well. I know you were busy during the holidays. Um, when can we expect the next live stream? It is a classic mail day, Jason. Kurt Schilling, Johnny Damon, Kurt Schilling again. Jerome Gamble, that's a gorgeous card. Jay Payton Cracker Jack, that's really cool. Uh, Kurt Schilling again, and the Schill again. That's a wonderful pack, I really like that. There are a lot of cards in there that I have never seen before. Um, which is always fun. There's a there's a lot of cards I've never seen before, and anytime I get to see a new one, I'm like, oh, that's a really cool design. And then it makes me bitter and angry with Tops for doing the same garbage they do year after year. I can't open this thing because I'm incapable. There we go. All right. I absolutely love this card. This is gorgeous. All those championship banners. Gotta love them. JD. Clay Buckles. Hanley. Carson Blair. Crazy person yelling outside my window. Steve Pierce. Jackie Bradley Jr. JD. Christian Vasquez. Benny doing Benny things. Clay Buckholtz. It's a great photo. This is a good looking landscape, landscape card. This one's not bad either. Bobby Dalbeck. Damn it, Bobby. Mookie Betts. Uh, hopefully Friday, New Year, new fun. Yeah, absolutely. Are you going to play some Jackbox this year, Sandy? Got some cards like yours from him, too. Very nice. Oh, yeah, you won as well uh, and got one of the packs. Mitch Moreland. Nice all-star stamp on it. Chris Sale. The uh, Chrome Refractor. Yes. That's back when baseball was baseball. Look at the size of that chest protector that Ump's got. Brock Holt. John Lester. Shane Victorino. I forget he played for us for a couple of years. Uh, J.D. Martinez. Michael Chavez, rookie. That's lovely. Petey. Gonna miss you, Petey. Carl Crawford. Completely forgot he played for us. Mookie Betts. Chrome Refractor. Lovely. Thank you so much, Classic. You guys want to open these little packs right now? Let's do it. I will, but it'll come later when I get my internet secure. Oh, are you having issues with that? Uh, Philip, I have some cards to send to you. Where do I find your mailing address? SSP, just go to my About tab up in the corner there uh, and shoot me an email. My email's right in there. It's just my name, philip.oldenberg at gmail.com. Uh, just shoot me an email. Uh, in my meeting, and they don't know I'm watching. <laughs> God damn it, I love Andy. He cracks me up. Don't get caught. Um, sign him, shame. Uh, yeah, I think Petey's done. I don't think he's going to be able to make a comeback of any sort. Um, 
We shall see. I want to have hardwire my laptop, not Wi-Fi. I can understand that. Um, I remember that night where you had to go to like the dining room. The Wi-Fi was real sketchy. Uh, he's still hoping. Is he really? I don't think he's going to make it back, but we'll see. Regardless, he'll never be PD again, right? Like he'll uh, he'll forever be a slightly diminished player. Uh, which is sad because he did a lot for us, and I love that guy a ton. Let's open these. I'm not ready for my rub down yet, so we're gonna we're gonna open this one. 2006 uh, tops, series one and two. It's not official yet. Yeah. Hey Frank, good to see you. Is the laser show really over? What laser show? Oh yeah, Pedroia. Uh, we'll see. I mean, if anybody can come back, he can. The kid's got heart. He's a fighter. Always has been. We shall see. Andy Chavez. Mark Puke Shera. Uh, Jimmy Rollins. Very good player for a while. Bunch of friggin' Yankees. Uh, Rocco Baldelli. He was a big name for like two weeks. Ronnie Belliard, uh, Raphael Betancourt, Scott Schoenweis, uh, Schoenweis, uh, Daryl Rasner, Brian Bullington, Joe Saunders, uh, Shay Hillebrand, David DeLucci, LA collection in the house. How you doing, buddy? Uh, no rub down yet, Jason. We're working up to it. Okay. I like to, I like to ease into things. Bobby Crosby. Uh, Mike Hardgrove. There's a nice Vladdy. Okay. With that. Oh, followed by a nice Randy Johnson. in a Yankees uniform, which is nauseating, of course, but, uh, Brandon Webb. I still, I don't think I had that, uh, Randy Johnson. Josh Barfield, which is funny because if you take the yield off, it's just, you know, Josh Barf. And that's humorous. Uh, Brian Bannister. Ken Griffey Jr., that's a nice card. Didn't have that one. And a good old Dougie Mirabelli. This guy was awesome for us. He caught old uh, Wakefield quite often. Uh, Italian mafia named Rocco Baldelli. Uh, great, great. You, I'm well, I'm extremely well. I think half the Cubs bullpen last year are still available. Uh, the unit as a Yankee, he was terrible. Welcome back, Parker. Um, y'all want to get rubbed down? I've never seen these before ever in my life. It is 1985 tops is printed on the back. Uh, Bazooka has it all. I see. There's a Royal in there. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. Two rub down sheets, one stick bubble gum. Okay. Let's get it. Let's get into it. Look how easy that was to tear into. There we go. Let's see what we got in here. I'm going to try my best not to touch the gum because, well, these are a little powdery. A little, I can breathe it. It's going in my lungs. These are cool. Dan Quisenberry, Steve Carlton, Bob Horner. Ooh, Strawberry, Pedro Guerrero, and Tom Brudansky. Very cool. Are these, these must be like tattoos or so. Here's an instructional card here. Uh, peel off backing sheet and put the picture you want on any clean, dry surface, color side up. Scribble all over the picture with a pen or a pencil or rub with the edge of a coin. Make sure the picture sheet doesn't move. Carefully peel back the picture sheet and presto, magic action, baseball rub down photo or temporary tattoo, however you want to say that. Uh, I love it. I will, I'm going to find something cool to do with these. Uh, anyone a diehard strawberry or 
Who else is good on here? Steve Carlton. I guess there could be a Pedro Guerrero fan in the house. Uh, it's kind of like tattoos. Yeah, they are really cool. I mean, the picture quality is good. I wonder what it's going to be like when I try to transfer it. I'm probably going to do old Bob Horner first. Um, classic did a video of these. I'm going to have to go back and watch that one. Um, classic has so many videos. Uh, speaking of which, that's a great segue. Let me go up here uh, and check Classic's page. Classic has 197 subscribers. I'm going to drop a link uh, right now into the chat. And if everybody could just take a second, click on that link, uh, go make sure that you're subscribed to Classic. Uh, I would love to see him get to 200. Uh, that's funny hobby. I'm not doing that. It does say on a clean, so I imagine they would come off on your skin, but the little photo makes it look like you're, I don't know, on a piece of paper. Or, I don't know. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. It's really cool. It's strawberries in there. Guerrero is solid. Carlton, Hall of Famer. Uh, good times. I'm not touching that gum. In fact, I'm throwing the gum away right now. All right. Uh, cause. What's up, Kaz? Good to see you. Hope you are well. Um, 198 for Classic. Thank you, Sandy. I'm going to go look right now. He is up to 198. Everyone, please do continue to check. Um, and if Andy's still here, if you click on Classic's page you see what comes up on his homepage. He's got playlists and uploads and all this stuff. None of this stuff shows up on yours, which is unusual. But we got to fix that. Um, Bo's in the house. Scratching Bo on the go. Good to see you. Um, and say it's a raspberry. Papa Jay, you're close to 600. Hold on, let me open... Um, Link in a new tab. Uh, Papa J is kicking it at 586. 14 away. You'll be there before you know it, Papa J. John! Good to see you, John. Welcome. Don't be Eeyore. Don't come in here all Eeyore-ish. Nobody likes me. I can't find my tail. OPC, that's OPG for those of you who are not in the know. There you go. Jaffa's up there. And we do have, you know, if you guys think you're subscribed, just take a second and double check because we do get unsubscribed uh, fairly often. Oh, wow. Okay. So this is from OPG. Okay. What are we saying here? Um, close to 200 peds. I'll check on you in a minute. Let me pull yours up real quick. Um, but I want to get through this for OPG real quick, and then I'll get back to yours. We'll check you out and see what you're doing over there. Uh, John, Papa J, love you too. Good. Uh, Bo, closing in on 1K. I need 455. <laughs> uh, that's true. That's true. Love all you guys. Uh, 63. Attaboy, Jason. This is, uh, I've never seen this before. This is zip tied. This is a straight up hardcore zip tied package here. And um, I don't really know what I'm going to do about that. Uh, my tools are in the garage. And uh, this is, let me see here. This is not really what the knife is made for. No, that's not going to work. Can I just slide slide them up out of here? Oh, this can't be good for the cards, but that's okay. And we freed one. Okay, this should be make everything easier. Um, just do your thing, Stash. Love your streams. Thanks, Peds. See? Yeah, Ken. It happens, man. It does happen. I know you don't spam, Jason. You're awesome. 
You're my Red Sox brethren. Okay, I have removed the zip tie, and now we are into the cling wrap portion of the unwrapping. And uh, it looks like there's a bunch of packs in here. This is freaking awesome. Okay, so uh, Nolan Ryan Express. These are, what, Pacific? Um, they used old chocolate bar wrappers, obviously, to wrap the cards. Uh, I have the complete set of those. Those are awesome. Um, although they did re-release this set later with a different, um, different logo in the corner. I don't have a complete set of those. Uh, take plastic off slide one. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah. Bonos. Yes, it is from Opeachy. Um, sent. Oh, thank you, Austin. Additionally, good to see you, Austin. Uh, I have been putting aside my Bryce Harper's. But I didn't separate him in the past, so I have to go back through the ridiculous 5,000 count boxes and pull the uh, Harpers. So just bear with me. Give me some time. Uh, I'm at 312. Lost a lot here lately. That's okay, Parker. You'll be okay. You're still over 300, man. That's phenomenal. Um, Philip, I'm a wimp with zip ties on cards, <laughs> Oh, Tim, thank you, man. I always love the way you butcher my name. And uh, today is another uh, phenomenal, phenomenal job. Well done. Uh, what did I get? Uh, 91 OPG. OPG sent me OPG, and that makes me happy. 94 OPG. 93 Fleer. Uh, this is Sportflex 95 Jumbo Pack. Sweet. And 1990 score. We're going to go. Uh, we'll save the OPG for last in honor of OPG. Uh, we'll open the score first. Sally Lloyd. How you doing, sweetheart? Parker, it's probably just people who you've met in streams that don't actually watch your content is more likely the case. If... if it's like the notifications. If you ring everybody's bell, right, and you get notifications all the time, but you don't ever click on them, then the algorithm says that you don't really care about their content. So you stop getting the notifications. And if you subscribe to somebody uh, and you never watch their, their content ever, like you never go to their page, they never come to your page, and there's no interaction there, there's no thumbs up, there's no comments, there's no watching, uh, then they unsubscribe you. It happens all the time. It's really not something to get too bent out of shape about. Luis Salazar, Steve Lyons, this guy with his name and stuff, Mike Lacoste, is Spikey Owen. I'm not reading those. I did that in the past. Eddie Zosky, I'm looking somewhat not entertained. Tim Cruz, not a horrible mustache. Alfredo Griffin, Don August, John Smoltz. Yeah, that's a good picture. Pete Harnish. Mike Thurmond, Mark Gardner, Mike Hartley, and Luis de los Santos. Um, let's see here. Looking forward to it. Set up my break table. Can't wait for everyone to still see. Okay, good. That's awesome. Uh, I'm excited for that, John. Did you get a break mat as well, or are you just setting up like a cool space? Uh, not bad for a guy who's sick as hell. I'm sorry you're sick, Tim. I hope you feel better soon. Um, people do care about chunk wax. Um, thank you, LA. Yeah, it does happen to all of us. Okay, yeah. Well, I'm just explaining the process because you know, people you hear people all the time complaining about losing subscribers and not getting notifications for stuff. But the algorithm, the algorithm is always learning. So if you don't click on those notifications. Like certain people's notifications, they'll come up. And even if I'm not going to watch it, I'll click on that notification. It'll take me there and then I leave. Uh, because then at least the algorithm knows that you want those uh, you want those notifications and you they will continue to send them to you. Uh, yeah, I still have the mustache, of course. I trimmed it last night because I went out. Uh, not last night, two nights ago. Oh, that was my stomach. Apparently I'm hungry. Um, I don't know. Striker's got a hell of a mustache, but he has a kickstand, which is the soul patch. 
Um, so he's not quite just stash yet, right? Like he's still sporting additional facial hair, which is, you know, like a kickstand or, or training wheels. That's how we roll. Uh, break blank, a 28 year old Niners blanket. Cool. That's your blank, uh, break mat. I got way too many notifications. Yeah, Dan, I'm perfectly honest with people. I don't hit the bell for everyone. I just don't. Um, but I'm on YouTube enough that I see when people post videos and see when they're live. And um, But I do have notifications set for for some. This is the 95 Sportflex. I've never opened a pack of these before in my life. This is a first. I'm very excited about it. And they are a little stuck together but that's okay it'll be all right all right and we're into them there's an ozzy smith gotta love ozzy good guy like it hall of famer uh jeffries not so much uh albert don't call me joey the psychopath bell uh, this is uh, Jose Real. Jose Real. Uh, Langston. Mark. Is it? Was it Mark Langston? They don't have. Oh yeah, there it is. Mark Langston. Okay. I was gonna say they don't have his first name on here anyway. Jose Valentin. Uh, Dwayne. Singleton Minor League 95 rookie thingy. And Hal Morse. Doing Hal Morse things. He's T-Bowing. He's T-Bowing before it was cool. Can't really get that last one to show up all the way. There we go. Anyway. That was fun. I like that. Sport Flix is cool. Um, let's see that porn stash. <laughs> Uh, the Prince of Tijuana is in the house. Joke, hola, stash, and everybody. Hola to you too, mi amigo. I enjoyed the video um, that you just did. Well, I guess it was a couple days ago, maybe. Uh, cards stuck together. Never. Had oh, yeah, LA. I just watched that video that you did on 2001 Tops. And I asked you in the comments. I haven't seen a reply yet. But do you think that we? it's safe to... It's safe to assume that there's going to be a, a huge, a very small population of of each row rookies that are gradable at a ten, with how bad those cards did over the years. Uh, yeah, I mentioned that at the beginning, Papa J. I mentioned that you were doing your 600 uh, subscriber giveaway uh, when I gave you your obligatory shout out at the beginning of the video. Um, what did he offer? Get enough watch time and buy in. I will. I don't know. Uh, De Nada. All right. Come on now. There we go. This is 93 Fleer. The Silverbacks. Uh, Hartley. It's a nice John Smoltz. Greg Jeffries, Dave Hollins, uh, Mike McFarlane, Mike Jackson, uh, Bill Pecora, Joe Oliver being sneaky, Pat Borders, uh, Milt Collier, Collier, Frank Viola. Oh, that's a nice uh, Tom Glavin career highlights card. That's very nice. BJ Serhoff. And some Jody Reed with a really screwed up corner. Uh, love you too, Papa J. No worries. I'll do it again at the end of this of the stream too. I'm trying to do the shout outs for the Wall of, of Fame uh, at the beginning and the end of all live streams. And then uh, we'll see how videos go moving forward. Uh, basically he would use PayPal and I would use my channel to stream it more than likely get free product and stuff. Oh, cool. 94 OPG actually more limited than people think. Interesting. Uh, yeah, 
Gotta love Jody, man. Jody was good. Spike Owen was good. Scott Koopa, he wasn't bad. Um, let's open the Nolan Ryans before we get into the OPG in honor of OPG. I'm going to sniff this foil and see if I can still uh, get a sense of the chocolate that was probably wrapped in it before the cards were. Yeah, this is legitimately just tin foil. Like they did not try. But the uh, so far the cards look pretty good. The corners, we shall see. So this is just that insert set. Um, I have all these. If you need any of these uh, to complete your set, let me know. Just shoot me an email or say it in the comments somewhere. Bobby, good to see you, Bobby. <coughs> Um, so yeah, there those are. Gotta love Nolan Ryan. Uh, 94, I don't think I've ever opened 94 OPG, so I'm gonna start with the 91. It's like a ding dong. Yes, exactly. Exactly, Dan. I mean, this is, this is what they use to wrap chocolate and such in. Anyway, I think the last package of this OPG that I opened had Robbie Alomar on the top, too. Ooh, eck. I like that. Ooh, nice Ricky Henderson. What does that say? 939th stolen base, May 1st, 1991. Ricky was insane. Uh, Chris Hoyles. Oh, there's a Donnie baseball. Where's Fitzy? Fitzy, you in here? Got a Donny baseball for you. Spicy Bear. Spicy Bear does whatever a Spicy Bear does. What's up, Spicy? How you doing? Looks like a snack I would pull out of my lunch bag. Exactly. Mmm, chocolate. I know. I'm hungry now. Between the hot dogs earlier and chocolate now, I'm going to have a stomach ache later. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. 94 OPG. I do not remember what these look like. We will find out momentarily. Oh, cool. I'm digging the design. Doug Graybeck sporting a perfectly respectable mustache and a more than respectable mullet. Showing us a little two seam or four seam fastball action there. It's a good design. I don't mind it. This is good. I'm looking, ex I'm excited for these. Uh, El Presidente. Jeff Bagwell insert, right? It's an insert. No, this is a special offer card. Very cool. I like that. Good old bags. Ricky Botalico. Don't get him near a boat because he will lick it. Uh, Cliff Floyd. I enjoy him on uh, Baseball Tonight, or uh, Baseball Network in general, I should say. Mark Grace. Eric Davis with a whole lot of chew. Uh, he wants to do an 86 tops break soon. Nice. I'm very well, Bobby. How are you? Carter. Good to see you, Carter. Carter's kids in the house. Uh, Kevin Mitchell. Looking like he's been to the buffet and to the Ray, the Royd table multiple times in a day. Craig Biggio. Julio Franco. This guy was not human. He was uh, definitely an alien. Kevin Toppany. Oh, Larry Walker. He's getting into the hall this year. I'm calling it. Uh, Jose Offerman. Love Jose. Dennis Boucher. And, ooh, Tony Gwynn. Love it. That's a very nice card. Definitely don't have that. Uh, OPG, I love it. Thank you so much uh, for this lovely package. So many pe awesome people in here. There are a lot of awesome people in here. There's 20 awesome people in here. Um, <laughs> he was not human. It's like Willie McGee. Willie McGee was a, uh, an alien. Uh, that's that's a proven fact. He was not a human being. Uh, and neither was Julio Franco. Or Franco, however you prefer it. Uh, let me go over to OPG. Now, I'm going to drop OPG's link 
Uh, now, Opichi is just a supporter. He does not uh, make any content, which is fine. Um, but he's a great person to know, and he's a phenomenal supporter. So support him, and he'll support you, I bet, as long as you make good content. Um, so click that link. Make sure you're subbed up to OPG. Thank you so much, OPG. I really love that package. Uh, he saw my channel and he just opened an LCS an hour away, has a lot of stuff and needs a breaker and asked me, awesome. Congratulations. Registering for classes. Good farmer. I'm happy for you. How do you get an auto stash card? Fitzy, there will be one in your next package. Uh, when I get, uh, some more Don Matting lease put together for you. Stevens, good to see you. Um, just email me, though, to remind me, Jason and Fitzy, just email me. Shoot me an email so that I remember. I try to remember a lot of stuff. Um, ba -ba -ba. LCS Jaffa is local card, st card store or card shop. LCS. See, everybody, yeah, everybody's on it. Uh, thank you, Sally. Thank you, Sandy. You are lovely and amazing, and I love you both. Um, let's see here. Okay, here's the situation we found ourselves in. Uh, I'm done with mail. The mail is done. What I have now is either a blaster of uh, 2019 Stadium Club, or we have that stupid Fairfield that's been on my desk for far too long. Definitely needs to be opened and uh, maybe burned, thrown away. I don't know. This is going up on the wall for uh, classic cards. Um, so I have a blaster of uh, I have a blaster of Stadium Club, or I have that stupid Fairfield. Or I have this weird uh, wrestling uh, mystery box, which I just couldn't say no to. I still haven't opened it. Um, I don't know why I bought it, but I just couldn't. I couldn't not. Oh, hey, OPG's here. Good to see you, buddy. You just missed your package. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, I have a bunch of 70s, 80s OPG Canadian cards. I really love the old 70s and 80s OPG for sure. Um, I'm late. Yep, no worries. Sean, good to see you. Uh, we learn something new every day, Jaffa. Blah, 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 blah. What is? What if the Fairfield has the hit of the century? It doesn't. It's a Fairfield. Um wrestling mystery oh yeah dan's in here i'm sure you would like that jason's going for wrestling just took a blaster it faded me they're actually pretty dope i like fairfields but the two i did today wasn't great open the fairfield it will stop haunting you uh well it's you know it's not really haunting me it's just taking up space on my desk I've got two votes for the wrestling. I've never opened wrestling. I'd be okay with that. Is the stash tops a short print? There's only 50, but there will. there's really only 49. There's 50 total, but 49 are going out. Uh, one of them is mine. It's that one right there hidden behind that stack. It's not signed. It's not numbered, but it is number 10 out of the set. So one through nine are going out, and then 11 through 50 are going out. But number 10 is mine. Can't have it. It's right there. Uh, number one is uh, for Reindeer Studios. Number one of 50 goes to Reindeer Studios because without him, I wouldn't have that lovely logo. Uh, also, I just adore him. He's a good human being. <clears throat> uh, okay. So now I have two for Fairfield. A couple for... Ah, uh, fuck it. Let's open the Fairfield, then we'll open the wrestling. Why not? Hey, Malone, good to see you. Oh, sorry, I hit the I hit the thing with my foot and the stuff. My apologies. Andy's back. 
Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Guess who's back? I'm going to fly through this Fairfield because I'm just so tired of seeing it and having it exist. Throw that on the floor. There's the crap pack. What is that? Is that 80? 88, I mean? Uh, it's got the Yaz puzzle in it, so I think that's 88. Oh, you got to tip this down. They don't even know what you're talking about. 88. Uh, more no. Kluver, Tyler Skaggs, R.I.P. Uh -huh. Jose Reyes, Bob Watson. It's a cool old card. It's a pretty darn good condition, too. Oh, it's got the. Uh, oh. This is one of those things. Okay. Um, crap. Jump. Tom Seaver. It's not terrible. Don't take a shot. George Brett. Uh, Paul Shuey. Wait, why did that go over there? Uh, where's the art? What? Where's the art from in the corner? It's beautiful. What art? This one over here? What are you talking about? You got to be more specific. I'm doing very well, Sean. How are you? I gave you my statutory thumbs down, but someone, yeah, someone, I had a thumbs down before I even went live, like during the preview time. Um, WWE relics could be for some, from some dangerous places or some parts unknown. Uh, those fearful boxes could use punishment. Yeah, they're really terrible. Clean white boarded on base sets. Yeah. Ass relic. Got it. Borders. Oh, clean white borders on base sets, yeah. Top right. Talking about this? That's I have no idea where the art came from, but that's an auto from Oil Cam Void. Um, that Dave Dave Durango got me. I'm sure is that what you're talking about? I mean, but I'm not talking. I mean, by the ball, Sally. I was asking Jason. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's just. Well, I don't know who did the art. I will look into it. It probably says it on there somewhere. Uh, and I will uh, get back to you, Jason. Dale Mahorichich. This uh, this pack is Mahorichich. That's what this is. Yep, Byron Buxton jumps right out of my hand. Russ, what's his face? Um, that guy, Bichette, I think that's a rookie. Pretty sure. And there's an auto. Luke Hughes. Who does not have a nice autograph at all. I think this is like the fifth, fifth Fairfield in a row that I've gotten a hit out of. All right, Papa Jay, we'll see you later. Uh, Carrie Wood, that's a nice card. Robbie Almar, OPG again. That's cool. Uh, Chris Widger, there's a John Smoltz. Felix Furman. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, Randall Jones, Carlos Santana Chrome. It's a nice Robin Yount. Upper Deck Legends. That's cool. Craig Gentry, Drew Hall. Ugh. Alex Rodriguez. Woof. Stupid panda. Uh, where's Dave Durango? This is not Ferkel. <laughs> this is Raphael Ferkel. Uh, Dave calls him Ferkel, and it's hilarious. Uh... Wow, an auto. Yeah, I've actually gotten one out of like the last five. Uh, Bobby Crosby. Uh, Laws, uh, whatever. Kevin Tappany. Uh, Juan Guzman. Kenny Maldonado, one of the best names in baseball. Barry Larkin. Uh, Dave Nelson. Tim Naring. 
good ball player. Uh, Keith Miller, Kenny Rogers. Hey, there's a nice Barry Bonds. Have that card. Uh, diamond, whatever. Uh, Neil Walker. Mark Pukeface Teixeira. Uh, Texas Rangers card. Oop, dropped one. Paul Canerco. Random card that I dropped. Ugh, go back to Toppany. Why? Go back to Toppany. Nobody in the history of cards has ever said go back to Toppany. Barry Bonds, Rogers, Miller, Mary, Larkin, Maldonado. There you go. Kevin Toppany. Only time this request has ever been made in the history of cards. There you go. Kevin Toppany. You get one out of four. Ke oh, Kevin. Good to see you. Um, I do surprisingly well with them. Jason, what do you want from the top? Any? Have you seen enough? It's burning my hand. Uh, I did those. Okay. Uh, hey, Tito. It's my boy Tito. I love Tito. Uh, Dave Magadan, Kurt Stilwell, Ken Caminiti going, where's the roids? Uh, just kidding. He's dead. I apologize. That was, in, that was inappropriate. I thought it was an artist proof logo. Oh, no, no, no. Mark Lewis, John Candelaria, The Hawk, uh, Bruce Ruffin, uh, Rafi Palmero. Mark Lacasse, Chris Bando, 86 tops. You know I love my 86 tops. Checklist. Steve Cook, Mike Sherpson, Jeff Juden, Kevin Young, Moose. Is that a Moose rookie? I think that's a Moose rookie. I might be wrong. Someone correct me. Um... You pulled fire, <laughs> the historian. Yeah, Jason just wanted to see that name Kevin on a card. Can't fault him for that. There you go, Lenny Dykstra. Good old nails. B.J. Serhoff, uh, Mike Heath, Billy something, Ball, Billy Ball, Cecil. Sorry, I thought that had uh, paper loss on it for a second. Uh, that guy. Sid Fernandez, Tom Hankey, uh, Warren Newsom. There's a good solid white border for you. It's not a bad one. Patreon Pirate. What's up, Pirate? Uh, second year? Okay. Uh, I don't know what this is. Uh, Jody Davis. Uh, Phil Bradley, Kurt Stilwell, Stan Jefferson, Rafi Belliard, another Jody Reed. Checklist. Scotty Cooper. Just talking about old Scotty a little bit ago. Uh, Urbani, Ruth Haven, Greg Gross, Gonzalez, Edgar Martinez. That's a nice card. Oh, 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 card blanche. Card Valanche, uh, Butch Hobson, Joey Cora, Jeff Jones, Dennis Lamp, sporting a very respectable mustache. Well done, Mr. Lamp. Well done. Jerry Remy, Mark Clear, Ron Reed, Jerry DeBazinski, and Orion Rua. Uh, not terrible, not great. Just kind of what it is. Four leaf. Good to see you, buddy. Uh, watch your channels. Max Pack Breaks just got his chat. Okay. I don't know if they shut it down, they shut it down. It is what it is. This is completely stuck to the back of that card. 
Thankfully, it's uh, Mike, who the hell out schooler. Uh, another Yaz puzzle piece. Kevin Mitchell, Perez, Eric King, Gerald Young, Lenny Dykstra. I'm so tired of looking at these cards. Steve Bedrosian, Bobby Bonilla, Randy Myers. Okay. I'm over it. It was all garbage. Almost all of that was garbage. Uh, Fitzy's here. Good. Uh, or don't. I'd be okay with that, too. Was that a lamp rookie card? It might have been. I don't know. I'm not going back to look for it. I'll tell you that. Okay. Now let's open something that might be mildly interesting. Dan, you're still here, right? Does it, are there any wrestling fans out there? If you're a wrestling fan, put down who your favorite wrestler is real quick in the chat. Speaking of lamps, have you seen... Oh, yeah, that's the Chris Sabo lab. That lamp is amazing. Um... Yeah, it's I forget the name of it. He said the name of the actual product last night when they marketed the lamp. And I forget what it's called. But it is made by Upper Deck. And it's really cool. It's got uh, just go watch it. You'll you'll see it. It was on the stream last night. All right, we are into the mystery box. Dan, how expensive are these out there? I only paid ten dollars for this. That's part of the reason why I couldn't put it down. Brutus the Barber BK. Okay, here we go. Now we got him. Mick Foley. John, you and I are right there. Mick Foley and Sting are my favorites. Uh, CM Punk. I was never a big fan, but I can respect that. Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Macho Man. Rick. Woo! Flair. Uh, yeah, I don't watch wrestling now. I haven't watched wrestling since, uh, uh, I don't know, like 2000, 2001, somewhere in there. Um, pull some sting auto for me. If I'm getting, if I get a sting auto, I'm keeping it. Okay. So this is 2016 heritage. That's cool. I didn't know they had heritage, uh, wrestling cards. Um, ultimate rivals. Interesting. Uh, 2017 road to WrestleMania. Uh, road to WrestleMania. Hulk Hogan, Jake the Snake. That's a good one. Can't go wrong with Hogan. Uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Killer. Because Stone Cold said so. Ooh, Rey Mysterio. Good choice. Goldberg. I wasn't a big fan of Goldberg. I actually I couldn't stand him. Uh, $12.99. Okay, so they were just partially discounted. A box that big, I figured it was at least $20. Uh, more Heritage. Um... But for 10 bucks, I couldn't say no to this for the content. And somebody's got to like this crap, you know. Send it to somebody. Pow, what the fudge? There's there's Ray Mysterio for you. Power chips? What the hell is this, Dan? What is this? Dusty Rhodes. Wow. Way to go back, Ken. That's a very respectable choice right there. Um, Some kind of hanger pack for Heritage. And what is this? 2017. So they're all fairly new. 2016. 2017. I don't know why I'm looking. I don't think it matters, right? It's just the wrestlers. Uh, they're a good deal. Can you smell what the... Yeah, nobody said the rock. Can you smell what the stash is ripping? I like it. <laughs> Captain Insano. That's good. Nacho Libre. Good choice. Good choice. Uh, yeah. Jack Black. He's a funny sum going. Oh, look at this. First card. First pack. Stinger. Bingo. I'm sold. I'm in. Sting. I don't like this outfit. Never liked the weird red uh, shoulder pads and such. Yokozuna. That's old school. Yokozuna. 
Dan, you'll have to tell me if I get anything. <laughs> Powerbomb. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Scott Hall, Kevin Nash. Uh, Scott Hall over Kevin Nash, for sure. Uh, very underrated for his wrestling ability. Scott Hall. Very good. Very good guy. Uh, Rosa Mendez. Hello, Rosa. Uh, Luke Gallows. No idea who that is. John Cena. Not a big fan. Darren Young. Never heard of him. AJ Styles. Never heard of him. Oh, they got Ricky cards? That's cool. I like that. Uh, Cowboy Bob Orton. Uh, Howard Finkel. I remember him. Sergeant Slaughter. I remember him. Um, Junkyard Dog. Classic. Viscera. Uh, Roman Reigns. Baron Corbin. Brock Lesnar. This guy's half Buffalo. Classic coked out sting. I like uh, I like the uh, the Raven sting. It was good. I and I did like it when he went to the Wolf Pack and he was all red and black. That was good too. Uh, AJ rookie good really. There was an AJ rookie. Think cool. AJ Styles rookie. That's a good card. Okay. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Finkel is Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkel. I love it. Corbin rookie card. I got to pull that one too. Okay. Let me pull that one too. I guess I should pull all rookies. I don't know. Uh, the cards are just like baseball inserts, autos, relics. This is, I'm interested. This is intriguing. I've never opened these. I haven't opened wrestling cards since I was like seven. They still have those somewhere. I don't know who those people are. Hey, there's The Rock. That's a cool card. I like The Rock. <clears throat> uh, Chris Jericho and Enzo Amore. I liked uh, WCW Chris Jericho more than uh, WWE Chris Jericho. Peyton Royce. Uh, I guess I'll open these. Um, AJ Styles is a good badass. Okay. Can't imagine what a relic card will consist of. I don't know. We might find out. That would be cool. Okay, now these look th this design very similar. Chioda. Jason Jordan, that's a rookie card. Do I have to put that anywhere? They have bull riding cards too? I need some of those. I imagine they are worth more than I think. I mean, I've seen the prices on Pokemon cards, and it doesn't get any, like, odder than that. There's a big... Do you guys see this? Look at that big... Look at that. There's a big-ass dent in this card. That's weird. Uh, Jason Jordan, yes, no. Oh, fuck it. He's a rookie. I'll put it over there. Have a good day, everybody. Got to go. All right. See you later, Isaac. Thanks for being here. Your brother is a wrestling master. Now, are we talking actual wrestling or like you guys drunk playing around in the back backyard? Page. Not the page I know. Michael Cole. Uh, the Brian Kendrick. Byron Saxton. Sami Zahn. I don't know any of these people. Brie Bella. Uh, Daniel Bryan Tribute. Something. Train. Luke Harper. Oh, I know JBL. Her. Luke Gallows. Her. Bailey. She's cute. Uh, JoJo and Carl Anderson. No on Jordan. Good to know. Favorite wrestler is my ex. Page is all up on the P-Hub. Oh, wow, really? That's funny. Um, all right, let's open this one. 
I'm really Dan. Gotta go then. <laughs> oh, God damn it, Jonathan. You cracked me up. Uh, Samoa Joe and stuff. Uh, Bad News Barrett. Uh, Finn Baylor. I don't know any of these people. Kevin Owens. Uh, Bailey again. Who is this? Bray Wyatt. And Luke Harper. He's got a respectable beard. He worked for WWE, TNA, and did Ultra Violence. Was a ref. Oh, cool. Uh, Rusa, these are easier to read. Shane McMahon looking really old. Hey, Becky. How you doing? Summer. Uh, John Cena. Zack Ryder. Daniel Bryan. Shane McMahon again. Undertaker. There we go. Choke Slam. Zack Ryder again. League of Nations. Roman Reigns. McFoley. There's my Mick Foley card. I like it. Oh, and Sting back to back. Those are my two faves right there. Mick Foley, Sting. Love it. The Godfather. I forgot he existed. Triple H. Uh, the Godfather used to bring the hose. <laughs> used to bring the hose to the ring. Sorry. Uh... I'll take your Bailey cards. Okay. Just email me to remind me. Triple H. Brock Lesnar. Triple H, yeah. Dan Leg Day Bay. What's up, Funkin? Drop the collections, huh? Uh, the Ho Train. Thank you, John. That's what it was. Asking Dan to be my leg day bay. Nice. I like it. Uh, ultimate Rivals. Jeff Hardy, John Morrison. Uh, Matt Hardy and Edge. And Tommy Dreamer and Matt Stryker. Whoa, weird. This is like a sports flicks card. Um, I forgot what Triple H's finishing move is, but that's it. Does it say on the back? Collect all 10 motion cards. Good to know. Um, I went ahead and they seem to be good cards. Gets the hose again. <laughs> That's good, Jason. Um, Striker! What's up, man? Ric Flair. Warren Anderson, Mark Henry, and Bautista. Mark Henry lives in Austin, Texas. Just FYI. I've seen him there. Uh, so does The Undertaker. Well, The Undertaker used to, at least. I've actually met The Undertaker on multiple occasions. He's a very, very nice guy. Uh, Dream is a cool card. The Pedigree. Thank you, Dan. Oh, these feel... Oh, these are cool. These are a heritage. They feel like the old old cards from when I was a kid. I like it. Coco Beware. Papa Shango. Rocky Johnson. That's uh, The Rock's Pops. Mankind. Now that's freaking cool. I love that. That's a good one. And Dude Love. The Rock. The Rock and Sock Connection. F5. Um, the pedigree. Striker, I really love that video you did. Um, talking about if I had a million dollars and whatnot. It was very good. Wow. Pedigree ball sack head smash. <laughs> it's funny because it's true. Lillian Garcia, Seamus. 
Batista, Akeem, Cowboy Bob Orton, Hillbilly Jim. Ooh, Vader. This guy was a monster. It's a cool sticker. And diving headbutt. Who did the best diving headbutt? Who was it? Like Chris Benoit? Probably did the best diving headbutt there. Uh, thanks, man. It was fun. Who would you buy? Um, I think Bellinger was a really good choice. I, I think Tatis is going to be epic, but you already know that. Um, I don't think Vladi is a good investment. I don't think Pio Alonso is a good investment. Um, Yaskrimski spent way too much time in the minors. So he's not a bad. Uh, he's not a good investment. Uh, I think right now your your two best young players with the most potential are Juan Soto and Tatis. Uh, I think, I mean, what can you do? Vader died in the ring. I didn't know that. Benoit, but but what? Oh, this is weird. It's like 87 tops. He's got a gold cup. What does a wrestler get a gold cup for? Is there a wrestling all-star game I'm unfamiliar with? Yeah, I know. Preaching the choir. Well, I mean, Striker, you're very well versed in what we do, right? And I mean, more so than I am. So asking for my opinion is, you know, is what it is. I mean, I'm still all in on Benny, but that's, you know, that's my heart, not my wallet. Um, so it is what it is. Uh, I did watch a video by LA Collection that makes it appear that the Ichiro 2001 Tops card is going to be extremely hard to find in a 10. So depending on where the price is, I might pick up one of those. Uh, see you later, Cause. Just soldier Vladi for a lot. Yeah. I don't think Vladi's going to do shit. But he got brain dead. Yeah. Well, I wasn't. That's morbid. I didn't want to bring that up. But he did have a hell of a, a flying headbutt. Big cast. Bobby Roode. Naomi. I don't know any of these people. Xavier Woods. I do like these cards, though. Uh, Brian. Bray Wyatt. Shawn Michaels. There we go. British Bulldog. Let's see, this is my stuff here. Not John Cena. The Rock, I'm okay with that. British Bulldog defeats Brett the Hitman Hart for the Intercontinental Championship. The Ultimate Warrior. All hype. All hype, no talent. All hype, no talent. All right, this is the last one. Well, except for this weird thing. Power. Power show. I guess I'll open this. Shit stain Nakamura. Yeah, John, you don't have to spell that out. Anyone who has been living under a rock knows that, man. Okay. Um. Oh, they're poker chips. Weird. Why would you need poker? Okay. They feel good, though. They do feel like, like legit poker chips. Um. Ted DiBiase, uh, Primo, uh, One Man Gang, and uh, Heath Slater. Uh, I don't understand what these are. I don't. I'm sure there's a game or uh, whatever. Uh, these are weird. But they do feel like poker chips, and that makes me happy. Um, I will not do that for hours on end, I promise. Is a game for kids? Yeah. It's all right, John. I just, you know, my, I try to stay positive. Talking about that poor bastard and his family is not positive. Um, oh, wow. These are cool. Hold on, which one were these? This is uh, 2016 Heritage. Oh, I need more of these in my life. Look at this 86 Tops design. Oh my God, I love these. 
I need the all of these. I need all of these in my house. Road Dog. I love DX. They were great. Miss Elizabeth. Rest your soul, sweetheart. Um, Xavier Woods. Sin Cara. Oh, these they even have the inserts, man. That's awesome. Uh, Ric Flair. Oh, now we're into these. Why do they look like these? Faces, triple A. Yeah, okay. Page. Eve Torres. Oh, turn back the clock. That's so awesome. Oh, Tatanka. There's a guy I forgot existed. And there's Jake the Snake Roberts. Very cool card. I adore these, Dan. These are phenomenal. Oh, you're heading to poker soon? Good luck on the table, my friend. Um, top coins, kind of, yeah. Never cared for tops coins. I don't know. I just want cards. I don't need all the other weird crap. Pages a wrestler. <laughs> uh, that pages. I really like these. I like these a lot. I may have to get more of these. Not all the wrestling cards, but these specifically, the '86 uh, style. I really like those. Tatanka was really cool. I enjoyed Tatanka. That was fun. Thank you guys for uh, bearing with me on that. Um, I'm not going to lie. If I saw another one of those boxes, I would probably buy it. You play poker with Jake the Snake? Cellmates in Vegas? Super jelly. I am super jelly. Oh, that was fun. Um... Oh, screw it. I don't know how long it's going to be until I stream again. I So I'm just going to open this. We're just going to open it and get it over with. Who's your favorite guy? Um, well, Mick Foley and Sting. But anybody from that era, really, like from 90, what was it, like 97, 98 through 01, 02. Of course, your favorite is Macho Man. Oh, yeah. I love Macho Man. They have hobby boxes, too. I may have to get a hobby box of that. Now, is it just the update on that year? Or is it all year that is... Because uh, that was update, right? Hold on. Let me see. 2016. Her okay, so it's just Heritage. So I need to get more of these. 2016 Heritage. I'm going to take a picture of that after I'm done. Uh, did I get everything into the box? I did. Back to baseball. Hooray, baseball. Now that my Patriots are out of it, I, all I can think about is baseball. Oh, really? I'd like, yeah, I'm going to have to look on eBay and do some research on that uh, to see what, like, the autos and everything look like. And uh, that hooked me. That hooked me right there. You show me some 86-style cards. I mean, come the fuck on. My, my, my channel card is 86 top style. I love that style. Okay. Where was I? Hinji Ryu. David Peralta. The king. King Felix. Ooh, Chris Sale. That's a nice bean team. I like that. That's a nice card. Very nice. And Eddie Matthews. Didn't they? Yeah, I've seen that card before. 16 Heritage. Those are probably my favorite cards. Feel a little excited. I am excited about those. I like the 86 tops. You put that design on something, there's a good chance I'm going to buy it. Aaron Judge. I actually had the uh, Stadium Club Chrome of this and I sent it to uh, to Lou Rock. Brandon Crawford. Uh, Victor Robles. Al Kaline. And Ryan Sandberg. I'm very excited for the new year of baseball. I'm very excited for the new Stadium Club. I love Stadium Club. Star Trekker, what's up, buddy? How you doing? 
Uh, I have ridden Space Mountain. I meant Stadium. Stadium are my faves. Okay, cool. Yeah, I love Stadium Club. Funkin' search Macho Man Star Wars on YouTube. Best hit. Best shit ever. <laughs> We'd have to check that out. Oh, where's Parker? Parker? This is Mark McGuire for you, buddy. Uh, Zach Granke. Somebody asked the other day, why isn't he PC? Maybe it was Dave. Why isn't he PC more? And it's a good question. I mean, he's a damn good player. Hey, there's a Kyle Tucker for Aranya Boys. Ooh, a Babe Ruth Red. That's nice. I like that. And Steven Strasburg. Stadium Club is glorious. Oh, there's Parker. Got to run. Have a great evening. Thank you again so much, OPG. Uh, I really loved it. And uh, I hope you have a wonderful evening. Uh, I'm opening 2019 Stadium Club. Uh, it was a blaster. Sally. Heading into Walmart to see what's on the shelf. Good. The very best of luck, Four Leaf. Uh, Elf is on the shelf as well. Well done, Jason. Uh, Pelican going to puke, poke you in the head? It's weird. Who disabled comments? Dennis Eckersley. Uh, Lord Escurial Jr. John Smoltz, Emperor, uh, Emperors of the Zone. Julio Urias, and a, yet another Sean Reed Foley rookie card. Nigel. Oh. Uh, from uh, Finding Nemo. Protect children from the hateful content. Stanton. Jake Bowers, rookie. JT Aramito. DJ Stewart, Sepia Weirdness, rookie card. And Steven Piscotti. I'd put a dent in it. <laughs> How do you fix a popper maker? I don't know. Don't know. Jock Peterson is a good kid, too. Really like him. I don't think he gets enough credit. Uh, Todd Helton. Somebody tried to tell me Todd Helton was better than Larry Walker the other day. Look at the numbers. They're similar. Walker, superior. This is a numbered power zone of fucking Chris Davis. 44 out of 50. Uh, Matt Carpenter. Enrique Hernandez. Steven Pastrami. Kenley Jansen. Saying, I use deodorant. My pits are fresh. Just ask him. Oh, Glaber Torres threw up in my mouth a little. Patrick Wisdom. Chris Davis Red. Ugh, this guy. Oof. The Chris Davis Hot Pack. And Akuna Matata. All right, last pack. I guess I'm done with YouTube. What are you done with YouTube? YouTube sucks. Oh, okay. Jake Lamb. I really like YouTube. Luis Urias. Uh, Lewis Brinson Black. You can hardly even see the uh, thing in the corner there. Luis Severino and Marcus Strom. Not great, not terrible, just another blaster. What can you do? Anything less is uncivilized. Now I have to watch Major League. Thank you, Jason. I love it. Um, let's see. What video was I supposed to watch right after this? I don't remember. 
told somebody I was going to watch something and I don't remember what it was. It disabled comments for saying a bad word, I guess. What are you guys talking about on this video? I'm, I'm confused. This is my hand, but I'm not sure what I'm sure of. Okay. 21 likes, two dislikes. Thank you guys so much, man. You guys are amazing. I really appreciate it. Uh, and that's it for opening. I don't think I have. Nope. I don't have anything else. Uh, I'm sorry. I'll stop. Okay. I call it the Terminator. <laughs> uh, that's Major League Two. Uh, Jason, did you like Major League Three? Back to the Miners. Did you enjoy that? Uh, don't be sorry, slob. I was just wondering what you were what you were talking about. I mean, I'm I probably missed it. Did they disable comments on one of your videos? I'm I don't understand. Bum, 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 bum. Damn, that oil can boy looks good up there, doesn't it? It's gorgeous. Can't see Jim. Jim's mustache is, uh, no, couldn't finish it. Oh, really? You didn't enjoy Major League Three? I enjoyed it immensely. I thought it was good. It wasn't great by any means, but it was good. It was really good. Um, okay, so I'm going to get my, uh, the Sean Tiford video out later today. Three was pretty lame, yeah. Yeah, on all of them, apparently. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I missed the chat. I was not searching for page. Sure you were, Jaffa. Um, so just a quick tease. I'll give you guys a tease because you're here and I love you guys. Um, woo. These are things that I got in the Sean Tiford package. Whoa. Not going to give you a good look at any of it. I'll give you a good look at this one. It's freaking awesome. Uh, he did way too much. Um, but... I got to get it. I, I'm just going to release it. It's 54 minutes long. I'm warning everybody right now. Uh, I bet they judge them for kids. Uh, well, yeah. What Did you set your channel to 18 and up slot? Tom, good to see you, Tom. How are you and how is your mustache? Chicken man. Because I know there's been some people who've gotten uh, gotten in trouble because they they never set their settings when they were supposed to. And if you don't, if you didn't do that, then you were supposed to actually set set it every time you uploaded a video, which is a great big pain in the ass. I don't know why anybody would do that. Anybody a Jeff McNeil fan? This killer McNeil auto out of a Dave Durango break. I could have swore it was numbered. Is it really not numbered? Wow. Anyway, Jeff McNeil. <laughs> mustache party, damn right. There's some. Th there's three damn solid mustaches in here. Tom T, Striker, myself. Uh, I haven't set my channel, just my vids. Uh, don't apologize, Jason. It's okay. One day you will be able to grow a, a glorious mustache. <laughs> Clean. Yeah, that McNeil. It's not bad. What are your thoughts on McNeil and, uh, and Alonzo, Striker? Of the two, which one do you think is more likely to have a long and uh, successful career? 
just getting off my back. I got like eight hobby and an 82 series, top series. Oh, uh, may I have the Matthews card? What Matthews card? The Eddie Matthews card out of the stadium club? You have an ass stash. Val Venus. Wow, Fitzy, digging deep. I forgot about Val Venus. That's hilarious. Who cut his dongard off? Wasn't it like uh, uh, Grendel or what the fuck was that guy's name? The pretend vampire guy? Didn't he cut his dick off? Anyway, both are old, but 53 bombs. Is like, really? Okay. Okay. I think McNeil's, uh, I prefer McNeil of the two, but I respect your opinion for sure. You're still live. Ran and Aaron came back, had lunch, still going strong. Yeah, I'm not much longer. I had a lot of mail and then I opened some stuff, which, you know, it happens. Uh, let me look for that Eddie Matthews, Jason. Oh, it was way at the beginning, wasn't it? Yeah, so. It's way at the beginning. Oh, shit. I don't know where it is. Let's see. It is. Talk amongst yourselves here. I'm hunting for Eddie Matthews. I don't know where he is. Yep, there he is. Found him. Um, paid for classes, 12 hours, good schedule. Good, Austin. There you go. He wanted that Eddie Matthews. There you go, buddy. I will put it aside for you. And once I have everything loaded up, enough for a package, I will send this and I will send you a, uh, a stash card as well um, linda rich man with coffee talk call me we'll talk okay well mcneil a lot older than i expected yeah i didn't even realize that that's a good point striker yeah i'm gonna steer clear of both of them actually um Yes, please. I met him before he passed away. He's just, okay. Well, I'll maybe I'll look and see if I can find anything else of his. Um, but yeah, that'll go out when when you have a full package. Okay, <laughs> that sounded terrible. Uh, have one nine a.m. course, but after that, won't have class until twelve thirty. Are you not a morning person, Austin? I like to get the shit done, man. Get it done. Try to enjoy the rest of the day. <laughs> talk, talk amongst just. I'm for Klempt. I'm for Klempt. Here's the topic. Austin Farmer, not a morning person. Talk amongst yourselves. Big Mike in the house. Hey, Mike, hold on. I got some. Uh... Ow. Oh, Christ, my knee. Uh, something I want you to see here. It's Tatis, Tatis, Tatis. There we go. Eloy, let me know if you have these, Mike. The rookie debut Chrome, I'm assuming. The rookie debut paper. Uh, rookie, of course, regular. Holiday and the Bowman Platinum. That's what I have right now for Eloy. Those are the four I've set aside thinking of you. Let me know if you have those or you want those. Stupid Vladi, Nick Senzel, number to what, 50? Yeah, number two of 50. 
<laughs> me in my 9 a.m. class is sleeping. Uh, I used to be really bad. I wasn't a morning person, but I am now. Did you see Barbara Streisand on Prince of Tides? Like butter. Like a big stick of butter. <laughs> Oh, God, I love it. You have them? Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, I'll just uh, I'll put them into the stack of stuff. See if somebody else needs them. See if anything happens with the kid. He seems to be pretty talented. Yes, everybody say hi to Big Mike. If you guys don't know Big Mike, that's Sport Card Collector 959. Fantastic channel. He's a ton of fun. Uh, be sure to check him out. And Striker Breaks, I mean, he's he's one of the goats. If you don't know Striker, you're you're just robbing yourself. I'm only a morning person if I've had a good night's sleep. Uh, I don't I don't know if that really constitutes being a morning person. I know people that pop out of bed at four thirty in the morning, regardless of whatever happened the night before. Madonna and Roseanne and Mike Myers classic. Yeah. Good times. Mike Myers, uh, underrated. Doesn't get enough credit. He's super funny. Austin Powers was my, my jam when I was young. Loved Austin Powers. I actually have a Dr. Evil action figure somewhere around here. I don't remember where exactly it is. He's 3K pounds of fun. <laughs> oh, man. I don't think I'm going to make it to two hours. I can tell you that right now. It's already 441 here. Uh, Got to figure out what I'm doing for dinner. I appreciate y'all being here, though. Nobody can beat my sweaty balls. <laughs> uh, Jason, you crack me up, man. Uh, I love it. <clears throat> Austin Powers does still rock. Um, the first one is epic. The second one is very good. The third one is, eh, it is what it is. Danger is my middle name. A lot of, a lot of vagina. I love it. Such a good movie. And I always forget that Will Ferrell is in it as Mustafa. I always forget that. So good. I was obsessed with Austin Powers. Had like three different t-shirts and wore a majority of my wardrobe in high school. Yeah. Uh, I can respect that. I love, love, love Austin Powers, man. I probably saw the first one in theaters at least five times. It was so good. Uh, I spent my teens asking far too often if I made people horny. It was It was weird. I want to hump a lot. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, I love her too. That was the girl from uh, from Third Rock. I always forget her name. You're in the past. Yeah, you are. In like Flint. That's my favorite movie. Austin, come drink some champagne with me. All right. Yep. That's a good one. He, he's got to take the elevator and take the stairs. Ah, I want to watch that now too. So good. So good. Felicity Shagwell. Shagwell by name. Shag very well by profession. That's right. I have a blue and white leopard print denim shirt that makes me think of... Oh, cool. <laughs> Shag very well by profession. This is a good one, Austin. I love it. Uh, Austin, I got to get... Uh, some oversized top loaders um because i've got i got a couple of harper box toppers unfortunately that i have to send with your package so i'm foxy cleopatra yeah see i didn't enjoy that one as much i do i love gold it's, it's good gold member was good did you try the hot pockets <laughs> <laughs> i'll take the babe Fitzy, you're my Don Mattingly guy. You're my Don Mattingly guy, Fitzy. 
I think that was a good bed too, wasn't it? Or was it a red? I don't remember. Hold on. Yeah, it was a red. I'm talking about that one. Uh, one clearance fat pack, 18, 19 hoops, one clearance pack, eight, 2018 gallery, three clearance fat packs, 2017 score Mahomes. Oh, okay, cool. I don't know anything about the football cards, but very good luck on those rips for leaf. <laughs> uh, it, it was Austin walking around naked with strategically placed props that had me sit. That's true. That was funny. Held my butt, hit my buddy down and sh shaved a V in his thick chest hair. It was epic. Oh, my God. I love it. Who, who throws a shoe? Honestly. He put roadkill on my bed, Dad. Bad man to me. I lost my genitalia to an unfortunate smelting accident. Had it replaced with pure gold. Walmart wasn't a total bust. That's good. <laughs> pure gold uh when he eats his skin well that's that's probably the reason i can't stand gold member is when he eats his skin it's just like ugh, terrible oh so good is that the one you wanted fitzy oh Yeah, spicy, spicy bear, spicy bear. Oh, let me get the uh, end of video shout outs here real quick. Uh, Funkin Mess, no longer Funkin Mess collections, just Funkin Mess. Uh, the King of the North, Mr. Urban Card Breaks. Uh, the one and only Papa J Cards. Shout out to Mama J Cards. Um, Wilmer Card Breaks, or Will's Card Breaks, a.k.a. Wilmer Rodriguez, a.k.a. the King of Jackbox. And the one and only Hobby Searcher, V. L.A. Collection. Shout out to Reindeer Studios, Dave Durango, uh, and all the other wonderful... You want a smoke and a pancake? Bong and a blintz? Uh, get in my belly. So good. Fembots with machine gun jubblies. <laughs> Where'd you get those? But How did I miss those, baby? Oh, I love it. So good. These boots are made for walking. That's one of my favorite songs, too. It's good. It's really good. Love it. I really want to watch Austin Powers now. Does anybody know if it's on Netflix? <laughs> I'll have to go. I'll have to guess. Uh, I guess they transitioned. I definitely thought I had the setting. Weird. Uh, have a good night, Philip. Later to all my friends. Thanks for hanging out. Good to see you, John, as always. All I wanted was some freaking sharks with some freaking laser beams attached to their heads. Uh, I love it. I love it. Makes me happy. Uh, oh, wait. I have another shout out. Where did it go? I don't know what I did with it now. Oh, here it is. Classic Cards. Until Classic Cards sends me something better, this will go up on the Wall of Fame. Classic Cards. Go check it out. It's got great content. It's amazing. I want to say he's closing in on 200. Right? Didn't I say that earlier? Where's he at? Classic cards. Closing in on 200 subscribers. He's at 198. If anybody out there is not subscribed to Classic Cards, I am about to drop the link into the chat. And I would really, really appreciate it if you would just go double check and make sure that you are subscribed to him. I would love for him to get to 200. Um... You couldn't stand Fat Bastard, Striker. Uh, Austin Powers has been added to Netflix, all three. Thank you, Austin. Couldn't get out of the parking lot without opening one. Got him a Holmes and a Sean Watson, guys. Hey, awesome, bro. Congratulations. Uh, both those guys are still in the playoffs, too. Um, I, I don't think Houston has that great of a shot. Kansas City, of course, always has a shot. Uh, I don't know who the hell is going to beat the Ravens. They're pretty, uh, pretty stacked, pretty difficult to deal with. Um, 
so we'll see. And the Saints got knocked out too. So, I mean, it's kind of wide open other than the Ravens. So we shall see. He gave you the creeps, but still love the movie. Oh, okay. Uh, see you later, Striker. Thanks for being here, buddy. Uh, and that stash really is epic, man. But you got to get rid of the you got to get rid of the kickstand, Striker. Get rid of the uh, soul patch. To, as long as you have the soul patch, you're not you're not sporting straight stash, my friend. I guess the sour cryberry got me and reported me. It happens. Love fat bastard. Look at my TTs. <laughs> oh, number one ninety nine for your guy. Let's oh, thank you, Four Leaf. It's my boy. We are one away. We are one away from getting classic to two hundred. That would be epic. I would love it. It would make me so happy. I appreciate that, Four Leaf. Thank you. <clears throat> Everybody, just double check. Make sure. You'd be surprised how often we get unsubscribed from each other. It does occur. I guess I am going to stretch this out. We're, we're already eight minutes or so. A little, little over eight minutes from two hours. So I'll keep rambling for a little while. Is there anything you guys want to see? Um... Anything you guys want to talk about? Oh, I forgot to shout out Recycler at the end. Recycler for my lovely stash knife. Uh, would you like some chicken? I've got more. Oh, a bit. <laughs> about frisky, are we? Uh, I'm already on his channel. Awesome. Thank you. <clears throat> In the middle of the day like this, it's just typically people that are always watch my stuff. So it's hard to get new um, new subscribers for people because I've already uh, I've already gone on and on about most everybody. I subbed last night. Thank you, Slop. I appreciate that. And I'm sorry you're dealing with all that YouTube bullshit. I'm going to head out for now. See you all later. Thanks for being here, Jaffa. I will pop into your next stream. I don't have to drive 45 minutes every day this semester. Thank God I live five minutes from the main campus. That makes a big difference, Austin. You're a big... G yeah, I know. I put his rookie card aside for you the other day. Which is why I don't understand why you're asking for the Babe Ruth. But, I mean, you can have it. I don't give a shit. You got it fixed? Good. That's phenomenal. Um, who else? Oh, Peds. I forgot. Peds said that he was closing. Oh, he's he said he's closing in on 200. He's got 15 to go. I can't get you 15, guys. You come in here, you need 10 or less. I can do what I can do. But anything over 10, I mean... I had people coming in one night that had like 30 to go. And I'm like, there's not even 30 people in here. And half these people are already sub to you. There's no way I'm going to get you there. Uh, I'm working on my tops cards. If you don't mind, I'll take you up on the, getting them sent to you. Yeah, sure. That's fine. Uh, just to email me, Sally. And I'll shoot you. Oh, I got another thumbs down. Sweet. I'm digging it. I'm new to life outside and in. It's okay. Just remember to wipe your feet. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do with those wrestling cards. I guess I'll just put them in a box. They'll be all right. Um, what else do I have going on? Oh, Rusty Cunts. Nobody has said anything about Rusty Cunts. Rusty Cunts. He's been hiding there the whole time. Just looking at it. Um, trolls? No, they're not trolls. I like the thumbs down. I don't care. And we've actually been surprisingly troll-free of recent. We really haven't had any trolls in here for quite some time. <laughs> 
didn't realize that. Yeah, no worries. Uh, good times. Absolutely. Oh, five more minutes. Christ. Somebody tell me something funny. Help me. Help me. <laughs> get, get to two hours. He needs to get out more. What he needs is, uh, you know, he needs some WD-40 and uh, a wire brush and a good scrubbing. It's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. But, you know, maybe it'll teach him in the future to take better care of his things. And then they won't get all rusty. Needs to get with, uh, yeah. Well, that's where he came from. He came from Dave. I got that in a uh, Dave Durango break. I'm not a troll, but a figment of everyone's imagination. That's a figment with a whole lot of subscribers. Uh, went to an art gallery once. Was a total bust. I'm disease free. Good for you, slob. I am as well. I don't know how. I don't know how it happened. I probably should have got everything under the sun, but it didn't happen, and I'm okay with it. I got a sweet Red Sox video coming, man. All right, good. I will be on the lookout. Is it coming today? Four leaf. Yeah, that is, yeah, absolutely. Went to an art gallery. Why did you have that Lego set four leaf? What are you guys talking about? I missed something. Who was talking about Lego? Three minutes, 12 seconds. Closing in. Anybody got any big videos coming soon? Uh, Four Leaf has uh, a Red Sox video coming soon. I know you didn't ask for any subs, Austin. They subbed you because they love you. Deal with it. Uh, nobody goes there anymore. It's too crowded. Uh, what's the difference between a buffalo and a bison? You can't wash your hands in a buffalo. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, that was good. Tim Wakefield, Pedro. I'm thumbing through cards. So why is there even a kid's YouTube? Yeah, I don't know, Slob. I ordered a fuck ton of stuff. We'll make a video over it. Good. Yeah, I know you were waiting the other night for stuff to process. So you can put in that big old order. That's phenomenal. I can't wait to see what you come out with. A nickel worth a nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. That's true. It's very true. Austin, when is that stuff going to arrive? Are you going to have that uh, soon? I ordered something off of eBay, drunkenly, and uh, they put these extra cards in there, I guess, to protect the top loader. I don't know. It was stupid. But what can you do? Oh, one minute, one minute 15. We're down to 11. If you see a fork in the road, take it and eat pasta with it. Got a 82 tops box searching for Ripken. Ooh, nice. You already got one order in. Good. We'll get everything by the end of the week. Phenomenal. Um, I man, thank you guys for hanging out for sure. Life's a beach. Lay down and watch everybody windsurf. No, why don't you windsurf yourself? Um, it's far better to be involved. Probably going to be a forty-five minute <laughs> upload on my Red Sox stuff. All right, pasta. Yeah, I don't like pasta. I I don't dislike pasta. It's just it's a waste of existence to me so i don't eat it uh although i'm hungry enough i would probably eat it right now okay we're closing in 15 seconds left found an eckersley in it sweet 
Is it centered? Is it really pretty? Don't answer that. I'm going. I love you guys. Be well. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, thank you again to Andy and to Classic Cards and to OPG. And thank you guys all for being here. I really love you guys. You guys make it worth it. Uh, be nice to each other. I'd rather bungee jump with a jetpack. <laughs> Spicy bear. I love that guy. Uh, you guys are the best. And uh, I will see you around the chats. Okay.